so much respect for swimmers. So much respect. So much respect for swimmers. It's early Friday morning. Uh, for those of you that celebrate Christmas, I hope you had a great Christmas Eve um, and got some good time in with your family and loved ones. Um, wishing you good vibes today and a Merry Christmas. So I've just been taking notes from the last couple of vlogs and one thing that I wanna start doing is kind of uh, creating more context around my day. This week's been pretty hectic, but it's pretty consistent though. Like, as you see, a lot of my mornings are spent with the children. Jude and myself are pretty much the morning, <laughs> the morning people in this family. Today, however, I need to work out. The gym closes at 12 today. I did confirm and verify my times. I need to run some errands. And Courtney and I have a bunch of presents to wrap before we head to her sister's house, which is where we're gonna be spending Christmas Eve. So yeah, nothing too, too crazy, but I don't wanna to speak too soon because the way this week's been going, who knows how this day is gonna play out. All right, so it's 10.57. Really, that clock's like five, 10 minutes ahead, so it's like 10.50. But um, if I'm trying to get to the gym, I gotta make moves because they close at 12 o'clock. What's up, man? What's up, man? close soon. I know, I just wanna get in the pool real quick. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So back at the pool, I have about 30 minutes to get a nice swim in, and then I just thought about something. When I finish the swim, I'm gonna go on a run. So much respect for swimmers. So much respect. So much respect for swimmers. How they come down, they flip, then they go back and flip. Man, that's some endurance. But once I figure this out, my breathing, my technique, it's gonna be game time. I just made it down the back without stopping, like in between. Day one and two, I was literally making it to half of the pool, had to stop, going about three, three-fourths, had to stop, and then make it to the end. Today, I'm at least making it down, take a break, down, all the way, take a break. I call that progress. Also, I know, you can, I know it's hard to see me in here, but if uh, you have any technique, recommendations, workouts, where you see a flaw that I'm doing, I'm open. Leave it in the comments.
man, this is kind of like meditation. And once I can figure out my rhythm, it's just about relaxing, you know? Someone on TikTok left me a comment saying, swimming is a lot about relaxing. And so on the way down, I was like really trying to affirm to myself to relax. And it made a difference. So I'm just sharing my thoughts as, as I go. A little bit, of, a tiny bit of procrastination here. But I'm, I'm having a lot more fun today than I did the last couple of times I came. It's starting to make sense. All right, so that was my cue to get out of the pool. They're closing. So good little 15, 20 minute pool workout. Now I'm gonna get my clothes on and then try to go for at least a 30, 30 minute run. places I'm putting the gloves on just in case it starts to get chilly but uh, like I said should go for about three miles and then call it a day and then start to prepare for uh, some downtime with the fam Alrighty. let's go I'm really humbled by this run I thought I was gonna be able to do more but looks like at best I'm gonna be able to do a mile mile and a half it's crazy the body's crazy anyway I'm out here getting it slow build baby slow build So that was 1.87 miles. It took me 18 minutes and 47 seconds at a 10 mile and four second pace. I had to remind myself, baby steps, baby steps, but we're out here. I need that run, I did. YouTube, 
I'm making this outro specifically to let you know how much you are appreciated for taking your precious time to watch my content. There's probably millions of things you could be doing, but the fact that you decided to spend whatever time to watch my stuff means a lot to me. And I just want to let you know that you are appreciated. Um, please, if you appreciate my content, I hope you subscribe. I hope you hit that notification bell, which will remind you every time I post. And I just hope you keep coming back, leaving comments, staying in touch. Um, I'm really thrilled to be creating content on this platform and I'm trying to do my best to bring you the most value. I'll end on that note. I'm wishing you and your loved ones many, many, many great moments. Stay inspired.